What is going on today, YouTube? Welcome back to another Asphalt Boxer vlog. So it's been a while since I've posted. I've been a very busy man, but this is the new whip. 2022 Elantra N, not from CarMax. I bought it back in February with only 7,000 miles on it. And I've literally been loving this car. Why did I buy this car? Why didn't I buy something different? Well, honestly, coming from a KDM background with the Soul, with the Kia, um, I really wanted to stay to my roots. Uh, so this car really is a statement in itself. Everything that you see in this vehicle is stock, except for the window tints and the painted wheels. Now I did buy the car with the painted wheels. I'm not really a fan of the black paint. I do have some wheels. Um, I will be putting on the car once my custom spacers come in. Um, those are ordered. I have lug nuts already. There's another reason why I had to do that. Shout out to Fitness Industries for being incorrect, but we digress, we move on. Um, and yeah, let's talk more about the car. So today is just a little detailing vlog. Um, I try to detail the car really every three months. Detail me, not just a regular run through the touchless wash, but really looking at the car going over checking imperfections as you can see i have one right here i do want to get this corrected soon um but really just looking over the car making sure everything is good everything is intact just to give a little bit more features on the car some of my favorite features of course are the light up seats um those are factory they are bucket seats up front um i'll walk over here so you guys can see them a little bit better so the bucket seating and the interior lighting really sold me on it. Um, these are very comfortable bucket seats. I sat in WRXs, I sat in STIs. I even sat in some Infinities with upgraded bu bucket seats and they don't come as comfortable and as nice as these. The interior is black on black, suede and leather. Um, very nice race accent and it does have blue stitching that does match the end performance blue on the outside this blue really sells the car it sold the car for me um <clears throat> you can debadge these take the chrome off of them and just leave the black you know i left the chrome on it i'm probably going to keep the chrome on it because my wheels are going to be machined so i do want that to kind of bring the accent and the lighting of the car kind of all into one piece 